So I'm back out for a bit of uh, autumn pike fishing. Um, the action I had last time was uh, has really inspired me to get, get back on the bank and uh, carry on chasing some pike. Um, so I'm starting off like I usually do. It's sort of like the set plan we do when we and Steve, if we ever go out, we uh, do a bit of uh, lure fishing, um, <laughs> which usually results in nothing. To be fair, um, we have had one or two in the past, but it's worth a try, you know. And then settling down with a few dead baits, which um, which is what I'm intending to do. Um, I'm going to go carry on walking now. I've been walking for about an hour with the lure, um, trying different things, and um, I've had nothing yet, not even a touch, not a follow or nothing. Uh, so I'm going to give us probably I don't know another hour, another half hour, see how I feel, and then settle down and uh, find somewhere I can put a few dead baits out, and um, hopefully. Uh, Get a few jacks on the bank. <laughs> Alright then, I'll, I'll, I'll see you later. Alright, ta-da. Right then, um, so, um, I've done an, almost another hour of lure fishing. Um, well, I didn't even touch, I, I couldn't see anything. Um, we've had, I think it's probably pretty bad conditions for pike fishing. Uh, although we had probably one of the first frosts of the year last night. Um, as soon as the sun's come up, um, there's been no clouds in the sky at all, um, and it's it's quite warm. It's, it is probably if I took my hat off and jacket, I'd probably get a bit of tan. But um, yeah, so if, anyway, I've settled down um, in a spot that I liked for a bit of uh, dead bait in. Nice bit of uh, coverage over there, and so hopefully um, I'll get uh, one or two out of here. Um, I've got one bait out already, and I've got um, this, yes, the old traditional bubble float and a sardine tail. So I'm going to get that out, and hopefully, hopefully I'll get a pike on the bank for you to see. All right then, ta-da! All right, uh, these are the, the baits I'm using for the session. Um, Oh, folks in there. Reduce the clear sardines. Lovely. Um, yeah. Be honest. Um, with things like this, yes, you could. I'd try them. Um, reduce the clear. Um, if you look, they're extra bloody, which is ideal for pike. I probably wouldn't keep them for like two or three days and then use them. Um, they'd have to be on the day that you buy them. But um, yeah, hopefully. Hopefully these bloody, bloody dead baits will uh, will have me a few fish. Right then, um, so I've been here dead baits out for about an hour and a half, um, and I've had a I haven't had nothing moving, and I think it's probably a lot to do with how bright the sun is. Um, so I reel in the rods. Uh, I've taken quite well, a good walk around and trying to find somewhere where I can place two baits and they'd be in the shade of the trees and stuff. Um, so I found two sort of spots that I, I wanted to try. So I've gone to the closest because it's easiest. Um, I'll put my baits out now. Um, I'm going to give this probably an hour. Um, and if I don't get any results from here, then I'll try the other peg. Uh, well, can't hurt, can it? So, so yeah, it's not, not as uh, action packed as last time. Um, I'm not having snatches and things ripping off the bait. But, um, yeah, it's still nice to get out. I, 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 I do feel like it. Uh, I'm still going to get some action. Um, a little jack would do fine now. <laughs> Alright then, um, I'll speak to you later. Hopefully it'll be a fish in the bank. If not, it'll be when I move. <laughs> Ta-da. Right then, um, it's, I've done a quick move, um, I was only there about 20 minutes and 
it was a lot more weedier than I thought it was going to be. So uh, I came back to my second peg because um, because I felt a bit more confident there. But um, I just well, it felt right, but I wasn't getting any sort of action at all. So I come back here because um, I feel slightly more confident in this swim. But uh, yeah, let's just hope. Um, just it's about half four now, and the sun's starting to go down behind me. Um, let's just hope, um, as the light starts to fade, uh, a few pike come up on the feed. <sighs> right then, it's starting to get cold now as well. So, so it would be n nice to get something for the effort anyway. Right then, so uh, you may have guessed I'm in the car and I didn't get anything in the end. I didn't even have a knock. Um, it went really cold at the end. I was sitting there, I started to shiver and everything. Um, it's proper hard blanking. Um, yeah, there's always a, there's always next time. Um, yeah. Uh, so. Lure fishing was unsuccessful, and then a bit of deadbait fishing was unsuccessful, and I was freezing at the end of it, so, uh, yeah, not a very good one at all. But, but, there's always next time. Alright then, um, that's me for now, I'll see you at the next session. Ta-da!